Dope. Hey, Hoffman. Yes, the beta. Beta. Very important you say beta dropped. Are there even destroyer like ships? Oh, sorry, Olivia, I saw that. Uh, I didn't see that. Yeah, um, so what you saw we had a carrier and we had two destroyers supporting us. Um, I can go through the list of a few ships here in a minute. We're going to start our Aragon run. Um, I haven't done Aragon in a long time. So this is our elite with the naked man on the side. That's better. Yeah. Um, if people want me to go through stuff as we're playing, like I can, no problem. Elite Vanguard. This is the very basic start. One of the the basic starts. Ooh, there's already hostiles here. Wing guard. Forager. This is the CAC. They're annoying pricks. So yeah, there's my issue with the. I want to look at this fight. <laughs> it. Mm, I hope this. I hope I can sort that out. I'd love to watch the fights, but I feel like I'll get sick watching the fight. Right. So we're gonna start out in our elite. Um, we're gonna do the thing. Probably do a few missions. Get a miner. Do the basic start. I uh, will focus on helping the Aragon. Uh, we will do the campaigns, but I'm not going to jump straight into the campaigns. Might as well get a decent ship first, right? Or a, a half decent ship. The elite isn't even a half decent ship. But this will be vanilla. For the most part. I think the only mod I have is the tech paint jobs. Because I like having my paint jobs. I believe you can also modify what color that is. I could be wrong on that though. Right out. So that's all we know of the universe in this start. So you've got to do some exploring. I kind of have, you know, the background memory of where everything is anyway. But for new players, there's one simple thing that I would do. We'll do it in a minute. As usual, I kind of bounce around. You want to grab all these stations on your radar. Uh, especially if you want to do a little bit of trading. It's handy. Because it's going to open them up as options on your trade menu. Get into that in a while. There's a whole thing there. We don't need to look at that right now. So you can see a little yellow symbol on the station there. That means that it is offering a mission. I do not want to attack an Aragon ship to do a mission. There is a build a defense station. I won't be doing that either because that costs a lot of money. You get a lot of money, but it costs a lot of money. That I don't have. <clears throat> Mine disposal. Don't hold your breath. That's around the gate. Okay. Well, we're going that way anyway. <laughs> so, we just picked up a mission from a station. It's going to pay us out like 40 grand. Which is not much in the long run, but we only have 10 grand. And this is just shooting a few mines around the gate. So, we shall do that.
yeah, generally a big fan of the, the new third person camera. Except for that one issue I keep highlighting. But hopefully, uh, hopefully there's a way around that. I've been looking through the options, I haven't seen it, but um, I'm sure it's there somewhere. Oh, that mine is following someone. Start on this side. Clear on one side first. Oh wow, the... <laughs> okay, it takes multiple hits now. I, I guess I haven't played vanilla in a long time. This is the Pulse Laser Mark 1, so yeah, it's weak, but... You would think shooting a mine might set it off. You're activating the mines, dude. drop. Salvaged electronics. This is one of the, the most basic missions you can do. Unknown object. There we go. <clears throat> Entering system. Second contact. Again, if you're new and you're not sure of the map at all. Um, so you're starting out with just this. Um, something I would suggest is just hopping on this highway. There's a, a main highway that goes through a lot of the main systems. <coughs> it's called the loop. And that's what we're going to do. We're basically just going to go around and come back to here. Although probably go to Aragon Prime. So we'll go to our left. This is a very active system. The Aragon and Antigone are at war with the Holy Order. They also have Vanguard. Xenon coming through from um, another system over there, Frontier's Edge. Yeah, we're just going to pop in the highway, do a quick loop. T 
duty. Entering system. Crew sight. Yeah, there's probably a fight going on at back at the gate there. <clears throat> We're just gonna zip around in our elite. Entering system. Pontifex's claim. Of course, the Holy Order are at war with the God Realm. The two parent factions. But there's always fighting going on there too. <clears throat> really handy if you just want to salvage after a few battles. You can definitely make a bit of money that way. Criminal traffic, criminal traffic. Entering system, Trinity Sanctum. Try more mines, eh, maybe later. So notice that, uh. Oh, no, never mind. Entering system, right promise. Don't mind me. <laughs> Entering system, Profit Center Alpha. So when we get back around to Aragon Prime, we'll um, fly over to a couple of stations for reasons. We'll trigger an event. Get that ball rolling. Entering <laughs> system, Silent Witness. We're already just back around. Oh, actually, let's stop in um, Hatikva's Choice. See if there's anything we can uh, pick up and make a quick few books. Entering system. This is actually pretty dangerous. Um, <laughs> see if we can survive this and uh, get something out of it. Although they are attacking the um, split, so that's good. I'm just going to grab all the loot while they're busy. <clears throat> EMP missile, eh? Mark 1. When you played up oh, there we go. We're being targeted. That's fine. M. So hitting shift E will um target the closest enemy. He's right there. Came straight at us and is going to die to the station. Maybe we'll get a few shots in. I think we're going to do much to him, but uh, again. Grabbing all of the loot. And uh, hopefully we'll just be able to upgrade the Elite, or <clears throat> maybe we can get a different ship. Let's 
grab everything that we can. Programmable field ray is worth um, a lot of money. Early game. Worth over 100,000. So just picking up a couple of them is great. Let's see what we can do against the PE, and uh, I'm curious if we can get one to bail or what do we do with it, I don't know. We have to hit it with EMP missiles. Hey Kev! How you doing, bud? Oh, and you know what I'll do? I'll turn back on the UI glow. Because it's a thing, we'll turn it on. Um. You can see the difference there. How was your stream, Kev? The United ships, 7 by Lowe's looks a great update. Has it so far? It is great, actually, yes. It is a really good update so far. Um, I don't know if you've looked at the patch notes, but the patch notes are kind of nuts. The uh, new Taladi and Argon ships look good. The new Xenon ships and Terraformer ships especially look good. That's a fight that we don't need to be in. Uh, you're about to see the new explosion effects. Love it, and I love the debris field. The debris fields. What is that ship? Which ship? Us. Like this one here? The one I'm flying? This is the Elite. The, the, the basic Argon ship. Uh, we've literally just started the basic Argon start, the young gun. Um, so this is the... Uh, basically, I think it's the Interceptor. Uh, might be the Glow and stuff. Or maybe because, like me, you don't use it. <laughs> oh, is that grayed out because we can't pick it up? That's nice. That's nice. So. Here's the new Behemoth E again. Or uh, anyone that's joining in. Bishmexy. And uh, this is the position of the new third-person camera. He seems to be going this way. Because Monitor. the Zyarth decided to send a ship through for some reason. Oh, yeah, and I suppose this is the new P. <clears throat> Physical Education Xenon. Also pretty sexy looking. And this is the only issue I have with this camera is uh Yeah. That can get a little disoriented. see if we can, um, I don't know, do something. Yeah, that's the new UI glow. Um, like I said, I actually kind of, I prefer a clean screen. So I'm, I'm going to keep it like that. Uh, 
And he's not paying attention to me yet. But he's at full health. I can't do anything to him at full health. but I can't do anything. I really need that support player. Also, if you notice when you get close, you get the... Uh, health bars for the um, earths pop up if you get in really close you get the health bars pop up which is nice they look like shrimps yeah cockroaches slash shrimps slash trilobites as we were saying I picked up space fly eggs. My ship is so weak that he's not even focusing on me. He's still just firing on the other guy. Grades out what you can't pick up, that's good. It's good. A little quality of life, that's all we're after. And again, the, the little debris field that at the point of explosion is nice. But the problem here is that the Argon are fighting the split who are both trying to survive the Xenon. ship but uh, as we discussed a little earlier the terraformer ships are the ones I really want I've got to wonder do the uh Devs play Star Sector to give that name the Needler. Now I just can't wait to get into a tie interceptor with this camera. Once the fight is done, we'll uh, give Kev a shout out there. I don't think I have any mods online at the moment. Kev yeah, plays a good variety of games as well. I presume he's going to be jumping back into X4 at some stage. A lot of Empire at War. Shadow of Mordor or War at the moment? Oh, I have no shields because I've been boosting and this is vanilla. I'm gonna steal my kill. I don't need shields. <clears throat> See there the health of the turd. Get him. 
Eat him. Boom. I did not kill him with that shot. No way. You gonna hold off on your interworlds run until compatible? Do you think? Possibly, yeah. I think possibly just because of because of the quality of the update. Um, it might be worth holding off. I'm considering pausing the MR run as well. To be honest, because <laughs> uh, I don't think it's going to be compatible. Until VRO updates, actually. If VRO updates and everything else works, then we can continue the uh, MR run. Uh, this is the beginning of the Argon update uh, run, though. So, back to the gun. Start with the young gun start. We're gonna get gather up our loot. See what we can sell. Um, as I said, this is now a static station, so this is one that will always be there, and it's very well done by the devs. Put that there, big defense station in Hitikva's choice. Lincoln, you'll miss it. Uh, Two hundred sixty thousand. 260,000. Did I run past the loop there? I blew up. You do love your dog place and this make yes. This is this is gonna make a huge difference. Uh I'm sure people are already sick of me saying it, but my only issue is that uh, this camera is now locked to the movement. Which can be blah. <laughs> so I just I'm hoping for the option to unlock it. Um Kev. Oh yes, Stellaris. Presume the Empire is still alive then. <clears throat> There's the new Essie. Don't target me. Why are you targeting me? Go away. Hmm. There's been um, updates to how turrets work. There's more options for turrets now. So there's an like, attack capital first, <laughs> attack missile first. So they've been given priority lists, which is great. Oh, crap. Is it just one? One is already too much. Um, no. And uh, we did notice then while flying through Xenon space that um, Xenon were intercepting us, not flying to where we were. As in, actively intercepting us. <clears throat> Which is pretty cool. Yeah, if you don't know Kev, Kev does um, a few similar games to me, but also does a bit of like CK3 and stuff. If he's still in chat, he should probably just shout himself out, it'd be easier. <laughs> Um, I'm not going to go do the mission yet. We're going to go to the wharf in Argon Prime. There. I'm going to sell everything I can before I get scanned. Doubt we have enough to. Um... Oh, I don't have a docking computer either, don't I? A little mini game for the docking.
I don't care about Seda, so I, I don't need to save all the stuff. Uh, we got one of you. We got a. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. I'll just sell all that. We'll get us a little bit of money. Uh, this is the only mod I have installed at the moment is the tech paint jobs because um, some of them are pretty damn cool. I can't remember which ones are which, so I'm just going to buy all of them. Three hundred thirty K is still enough to it's enough to upgrade the ship. It's not enough to buy something else. I have to do a new vanilla run now, damn it. My wait for VRO that that usually updates pretty quickly. I would be hoping that VRO would be compatible with the vanilla save, so you can go from vanilla to VRO but not back. They don't work great on the um, on the elite. We can make ourselves kind of in inconspicuous. I like that actually. Let's go with that. Is that a neon pink one? Maybe. Um, if you're wondering, oh yeah, your extensions are now in your settings. That's the thing. Um, don't mind all of this. <laughs> Tech paint jobs collection. That that is the mod on the Steam Workshop. Made by Space Weep Commando. There you go. Elite Vanguard. Yeah, so like we have all Mark 1s. Um, get our stats back up here. I'll go for the Combat Mark 2s. Go for the Combat Mark 2s. Gonna cost us 50. Get the better shield, of course. God, yeah, the seals are so low. I get, oh man. Go for the Mark II pulse laser. So we can do something. Barely. Uh, that's 142k. We'll get the Mark II docking computer and we'll get the. No. I'll get the police scanner. And we'll sell all of these. I'll repair. <clears throat> I'll take two crew members. Digging crew members, not marines, because I'm probably going after small and medium ships, so we don't want to use marines because they'll damage the ship. Sorry, stretch there. Now, bear with me another second. So the 7.0 over 7.0 overview is processing into HD, so that'll be ready in about an hour. Uh, I'm just jumping out of the game real quick to do something. The game pauses lately. Um, I need to change that again. Excuse me. Da, 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 da. Okay. 
this. We're going to make a copy of that. Back in the game one second, guys. <clears throat> I'm trying to uh, get on top of this so that I can actually get this out before going to work. Because uh, most people already have their uh, videos out for the 7.0 update. Appreciate people hanging out. Hope you're having a good uh, Friday. Nope. It is Friday, isn't it? Holy crap. Download that. And I swear I'll be back in the game in a second. your time off work coming up when you mention pretty soon uh the end of the month uh, 29th so after manor lord comes out <laughs> uh, my brother is actually getting married next weekend so uh, i probably won't be around on the saturday at least and um, we'll start that and i'm gonna set that to go public Time is it now? It's one o'clock. I'm gonna set it to go at two o'clock and then I'm gonna remove the other video that I had going up. Still checking your video. Da, 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 fine. <clears throat> Sorry, I have to do all the admin stuff. But yeah, the end of the month um, should be that. And then this one can go out tomorrow. Okay, sorry about that. There you go, that's how long it takes to set up a video. If anyone ever tells you any BS that they spend all day setting up a video. Slightly more survivable, slightly more maneuverable. Uh, we'll go blow up these mines real quick. Um, just that one, because I usually, uh, it's my birthday the week before, so I usually take that week off, but I said, <clears throat> with Manor Lords coming up, um, I'm very much excited for that game. Between that and Falling Frontiers, they're the, the, my two most anticipated games this year. So, I wanted to have the time to do it and not be knackered from working. <clears throat> Especially because I've been very lazy lately and unfit, and um, it's kind of catching up with me, so I need to sort that out too. Now, we have a little bit of an upgrade. We're going to pop in and do this mission real quick. The Xenon are spread all over the place. Uh, find a target ship and fly to it. Nah, we'll be okay for that now. 
Again, if anyone wants me to have a quick look at stuff while we're doing this, just let me know. And we shall. Entering system. Silent witness. Oh, strike criminal traffic, that's what it was. I was like, what are we doing? Hey, it's actually focusing on us. Where? That's another change. That seemingly the um, camera didn't do before. Also, we have the, the new engine. And we have two males. <clears throat> That's not that. So the Hatikva storyline and the Boron storyline. Interesting that this is a uh, more color. A lot more color in the, um, the UI, which is nice. And see the difference in the maneuverability. Sorry if that's a bit jarring for people. Uh, that a patrol mission. I knew I could count on you. Yeah, we'll do that in a minute. I'll accept that, but we'll do uh, this first. Civilian ship A. You better. So how many of these do we need to kill? Could be a crazy man, isn't it? 30. Oh, Jesus. So we're going to go do the other mission. <clears throat> no wonder that's worth a quarter of a million. Come back to that one. Might do that one off stream, you know. Hey, Nordish. Who needs 3.23? <laughs> the dichotomy of space games. Yeah. Yeah, it's actually, uh, it's looking like it's going to be a really good patch. Again, uh, as usual, I'm looking forward to the mods that are going to be built off this patch. Yeah, I am. Uh, it's chunky. And this is only the beta as well, so things will change it still. Which is why I'm harping on about that camera, because. Fingers crossed. Cover the pirate. Minotaur, raider. Hmm. I wonder who the pirate could be, eh? What are you, this guy? Triacle, Vanguard. 
Minotaur Raider. Are we going to pick two mode? Which is scan mode, and then we can hit Shift F. Minotaur Raider. Oh, look! He's a pirate. Uh, the station is going to kill him. Um, I'll join in in a second. No. Serious damage. Greater. Ooh. Yeah, because he has multiple turrets. Dead now, though. So I was hoping to get the kill there, but obviously not. Um, wait, what, really? Minotaur. Oh, yeah, this is another Minotaur. And again, you can see the HUD has changed, which is a nice little feature, so you know which mode you're in, or if the mode is active. That's very good. Quality of life. Oh. Oh, the scan didn't fail the second he got out. That's good. Minotaur Raider. Well, they clearly know who that is because they're firing at him. Swarm missile. Oh god. I have no countermeasures left. Okay, we need to use the station as cover. Incoming missile. Nope. Sorry, station, but that needed to be done. <clears throat> he has a feckin' cluster missile launcher. I think timelines will be the last DLC. I'm curious if it's off as a bearing swipe. I have no idea, man. I have no idea. <clears throat> you kind of have to be thinking, um, what, what could they add? You know what I mean? What could they add after timelines? He's being really annoying. Laser Tower Mark One. Short range transporter A. Minotaur Raider. Probably the drones are going to be um attacking this guy now. Take a hit there. Co op multiplayer will be the next step, but I'm sure. Oh, uh, well, yeah, that's the multiverse, though, right? Isn't that in timelines? Or, like, uh, the final version of. 7.0, I mean. Oh, auto save. Oh, auto save. You're what? I couldn't hear you.
Again, I'm going to keep harping on about. Love the little uh, debris field. Docking avoided. Alright, on to the next station. That was only the first station. <laughs> Aaron, e. So, here is one of the new Taladi ships with their new design at the back. I guess the front is a little different too. But uh, I think it does change them up a lot. I like it. Uh, we got a mail again. Oh, that's the... Yeah, okay. Thanks for your help. Your help. Nearly got plus ten with the uh, Argon. Minotaur Raider. But I'm just gonna make sure that I'm scanning them, even though I don't need to, just so that uh, I don't take any rep hits, just in case. Oh, you can't do that. Hey, will you stop firing? But no, it worked pretty well. Gotta sort out their radios, they keep cutting off. See, we're still in scan mode, so we have that purple hood. Now we've aborted the scan mode, so we're back to the standard hood. Yeah, I suppose the multiverse is going to be the main thing. If they get the multiverse working the way they want it to. Um, that'll be interesting. But again, all those features are in the menus and everything already. So... We shall see. Docking granted. I may have been upside down there. Can I show the two cockpit modes? What do you mean the two cockpit modes? There are two views now. That was um, if you go onto Steam, here, let me do the thing. Uh, here, here, here. Uh, there. Here. Go here. Follow this link. Give it a second. There is a password there. So what you will do is, um, I don't know if it'll allow me to do it, but you go here, you go to properties, you go to betas, type in that password there. It is cap sensitive. And um, you'll get the option there if you don't already have it, and then you just put it onto the public beta. 
because it is public. But you can toggle first person in the cockpit. Edit follow camera position. Control E. Interesting. I don't see um, that. Like there's. We got plus 10. Yeah, I don't see that as an option. Is that in capital ships, maybe? How much money do we have? We have 267k. I need more. Uh, I don't need the. Uh... You seen it in the video? And it looks very immersive. In which video? Their their release ver version. Are you sure that wasn't just um, the stream camera following someone? You can basically adjust the perspective. I know you can adjust the FOV. Docking avoided. So if I go to the stream camera. Do you mean the, the zoom, the tactical zoom thing? That's all I can think of. I could pull up the trailer and we could watch it and see. It was you in first person, you could adjust how far you look over your surrounding inside your cockpit. That is FOV. This is your FOV here. So you can max out your FOV to 120. Standard is 90. Um, I could pull up the video here. Right, if you let me know a timestamp and then we'll watch it. You can keep an eye out for it. So, um, money. I need more money. I could go into Aragon and just um, do a quick bit of crystal mining for people to see that. Good stuff, that's still in the game. I 
wonder, is there a bunch of, uh... Uh, oh, okay. I was like, is that an abandoned ship? T. Oh, already. Autopilot disengaged. What's going on over here? Oh, a hype card. The FOV slider was a cut in the video. Ah, right, 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 right. Yeah, yeah, that, that's the thing about video editing. Jank in first person with the movement. If I watched Captain Collins' video, the like the short explanation video, uh, kind of yeah. I just read the patch notes though. So <laughs> also, I have my own video going out at two o'clock. back here. Yeah, I was going to do... Let's try some crystal mining. I haven't done that in a long time. Again, possible ways to start the game. Do a couple of missions, get a little bit of money, get a mining ship together. I come out here to the asteroids. Argon Prime is usually a decent spot for it. You're looking for a white flashing light or can see the crystals themselves that's even better like that one on that tiny tiny asteroid Oh, was the... the <laughs> hey, Jarek. Uh... The thing not playing? There we go. Like, what's going on? I can see his chat before I hear him. 
How are you doing, man? Ho hope your uh, recovery is going well. You want to see these little flashes here? I assume Kev rated her today, yeah. <laughs> when I shoot the crystals double down O nom 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 yeah, I did see one there Is that three clusters oh now is that counted as one cluster or is that actually three clusters Counted as one. Okay. I was gonna say that that would be crazy. <laughs> Visual effects too. Oh, is the emote thing happening? I will. Uh, I'll tell you what, Derek. I'll try and get a a pingu thing. I can see if I can add it to the the thing. I don't know if it, a, a green screen of Pingu exists, but uh, we can try. I'm not going to spend too long looking for these. They do limit it, don't they? After you collect a few, there's others that just don't spawn for a while. Back when X4 released, this is pretty much how everyone started, right? Once they realized, hey, uh, these things are worth a lot of money. Of course, I'm probably flying past like half a dozen of I don't have the reach of uh, a lot of other content creators, so all the views are very much appreciated on the videos when they do great. Can you do this part time between work and sleep? Mainly work. I don't think you were around yesterday, but we've started our uh, um, workers and resources map on Ireland. <laughs> I was going to do the UK and Ireland, but um, that map wasn't to a similar spec, and I didn't bother looking for others. Alright, um, I have not been seeing any flashes. There's one. There's two, actually. Ah, the yellow stuff. Anyway, <clears throat> we, could, we could do that for ages. We don't want to do that for ages. So he's going to go to the nearest station and sell them. That is a boarding mission. Oh yeah, we'll just go board that. Yeah, no problem. That'll happen. It's still the same music, yeah.
Yeah, but there's no custom houses on the map, so it's all going to be ship exploits. <clears throat> I had to turn off full realism mode so that we could buy vehicles, but uh, other than that, we're going to be doing a uh, realistic mode. If you ever want to jump over a railing, just jump with space and then tap C when you're in midair. Oh, I picked up crystals. Oh, they're not worth that much. Hmm. I guess you want to be doing a serious amount of it then to um, Good luck out there. make enough money out of it. How much is a drill? A drill is the uh, medium. Oh, that station is under attack? That's very much into the system. Uh, a drill. Oh, we can afford a drill. Yeah, okay. Well, so uh, we'll get our first miner. Be ready in one minute. I mean, looked at the map mods until you scroll through them, a fair few of them. There's so many mods for that game. <clears throat> Elite Vanguard. Uh, I hadn't looked at much of them myself, to be honest. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, there's there's so many mods for that game. Um, let's see what's attacking that station. <clears throat> if there's a fight happening, there is loot being created. I'd say maybe one or two ships got through the the defense station. The station right here. If there's loot, it's worth to poke it. Yep. Hello, oh, it's Yaki. That's a large Yaki group too. So, if anyone doesn't know the Yaki, they're assholes. That is a that's a huge raiding group. Holy crap! Yeah, I don't want to get involved in that at all. They'll rip me apart. <clears throat> Great to see them being active, but they'll rip me apart. Now, will I go and pick up the slop when they get wrecked by the Colossus and the Behemoths over there? Yes. Didn't mean to do that either. So yeah, I'd love just to be able to stabilize this camera. Well, they're going in over there. Okay, let's go. Maybe we do poke it. If we could get one of them to bail, that would be insane. Not going to happen, but it would be insane. Station can get one of them to bail, I mean. I think that's a Star Wars seven by no test, but that's fine, we'll use that. Alright, we'll go after the Maria. It's a light fighter, very nimble, but not as survivable as the Kurakamis. Uh, much more deadly than us, so again, if we could get him to bail out, that would be sweet.
Loot. <coughs> don't mind me. I really don't mind me. Just ignore me. <coughs> My voice is going in. It's awesome. I'm not talking. You should reconsider talking to me. We're gonna get killed by the station. This real quick, we'll go up there, grab all that loot. The only reason we're here. Love that the turrets are on fire now when they get wrecked. Give you a good indication of what is uh, active and what is not. Those little things that help out. Kurakamis are getting wrecked, which is good. They have enhanced quality mods. Careful there that I didn't shoot the station. That was definitely worth following. Let's do a quick flyby and drag in anything that we can. Interesting to see that size of a raid though. there perfect right um we were doing something oh we were coming to check out the station that was getting attacked but then obviously uh it was probably these guys attacking it and our miner could now be ready we open up this we can give them standard local auto mine um, for silicon anchor space what can the anchor space not be argon prime I guess it doesn't have silicon then anymore hold on cancel that There you go, it doesn't have any uh, resources anymore. It's interesting. Okay then, um, local auto mine. Silicon. Yes. Black Hole Sun is probably the safest. I haven't seen a silicon refinery there, but I would expect there is one. We'll have to go look. Again, like we haven't we haven't explored fully all the stations in those systems, so we might have to go um do that now. Let's actually do that now so that we can uh make money. Auto 
frame E mineral. Look at you in the red. Yeah, that, that new tail section is nice. Flows in and ships now, a couple of them in here. Not all of them. Do, 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 do. Entering system, second contact. That should be the link to the uh, 7.0 overview that we did at the start of the stream. Autopilot disengaged. It's now up on the YouTubes. All the support on that is appreciated. Uh, if we go ships, we can go combat ships, fighters. Oh, we actually have it here. Hold on, hold on. Make sure I'm not flying off into no man's land here. Um, I guess we saw a bee somewhere. So this is the terraformer ship. Created at the same time as a smaller F class. Complement the larger construction projects. The bees' main armor are cutting beams. Initially programmed to prepare materials for other ships to use. The bee proved to be effective in offensive role as well, mostly due to its robust hull. I'm pretty sure this, with a crew capacity of six, um, the new PE with a crew capacity of one. Um, harder to see there, but it is an updated version of the P. Uh, it is actually pretty sleek looking in combat. And we don't have the others there yet. When did we see a B? And then, oh, okay, well. The uh, two new Argon ships, which are pretty sweet. Oh, I guess everything else we saw wasn't a combat ship, right? Yeah, there's the Heron E. And then uh, mining ships. The SE is the new S, obviously. Crew capacity of one. Uh, if we go to... Oh, they have crew capacity of one as well, technically. We can't pilot an M now, can we? Not the M we want anyway, it's the F. That F looks cool. Uh, we did see the F at the end of the 7.0 video. those stations on our oh wait let's do a ping hold down r with shift to three and we're just going to do a flyby on these stations so that we have them uh or refinery oh there's a silicon refinery right there so that's perfect um for this system need to see if um, we can find a silicon refinery in Black Hole Sun. Otherwise, we just bring them back in here. This is a slightly more dangerous system, though. And then the H is the uh, terraformer capital, I'd say. Which is also pretty cool, and I want one. 
that's going to be a goal. Um, that's purple. Unknown object. Pink, purple, one of them. Put that of all, is it? <clears throat> if anyone's wondering about the music, it's just a Spotify playlist with a bunch of the X series music and um, some Brigador stuff. If you're wondering why it doesn't correspond to what's going on in the game. <clears throat> Preventative measures to strike criminal traffic again. 53k is not bad. And a boarding operation. Yeah, it's a data vault. Oh, they now have a symbol as well. Might as well do it while we're here. Elite Vanguard. Pop into our spacesuit. <clears throat> See those red panels there? one on the other side here. <laughs> Make sure there's not another red panel over here. Like that one. <clears throat> Mini puzzles on the data vaults just um, have to repair the panels that unlock a series of patches and such. And then the last one will have a little bit of loot and a signal leak. Signal leak is next door there. We haven't unlocked the HQ, so we're not getting contacted by Boso at the moment. But we still need to do that. Very nippy. It's a bunch of wrecks. No, it's just the laddie ships. Never mind. There is combat over there. I was going to go in and uh, look for the factory in full sun, but I got immediately distracted by combat. Another PE. Keep forgetting this is not VRO, I don't have 5 kilometer range. Sentinel. The uh, the boost on the elite though is kind of crazy. 
Alright, more loot. I didn't, uh, I didn't sell after we met the Yankee, did I? So, uh, we'll do that in a minute. Bad idea, bad idea, bad idea. Ooh. Yep, bad idea. And the frames are back. Frames are back. Don't fire missiles. I kind of need to go over there. Paranid are fighting the Argon or the Antigone or whoever they are. Like I said, this, this can be a great system for just picking up random stuff. Seems to be a little bit of an issue there. Pretty sure that ship is solid in the middle. Anyway. to this side the gate up here there's a bunch of stations over there though I guess we can hit them first good just want to find a silicon refinery so that our guy has no issues selling his stuff all parts Unknown object. Oh. Oh. It's all mines, is it? Yeah, a bunch of mines randomly. okay uh, if you're ever looking at distant objects like this there's two unknown objects one is a ship that's a ship because it has a code after it that's a gate because it just says unknown object then that is obviously a station it says unknown station they're a free ship here I forgot about that. All systems operational. Processing underway. Acknowledged. We are standing by. This is Salvage Team. Last scrap queue process. Ready for pickup. Acknowledged. Picking up cargo. 
cargo secured. Clearing the area. We're all done here. Setting course for home. Should be able to get there before the tide. Understood. See you back home. I do like that they just moved the stuff out of the way. Wait, that is a ship. up there. Okay, yeah, the Yaki came through here too. Holy crap. Another ore refinery? Or refinery. I was looking at that ship and I was like, I don't have a ship there. That's the uh, Ministry of Finance. Um, so I guess I'm going to set him to go into second contact too. Just so that he can actually sell his stuff. Or refinery, super highway, unknown sector. And we'll go fly around a bit. The Yaki went hard, didn't they? got wrecked, but they went hard. Maybe minefields. Black Hole Sun. Alright, we'll go ping a few stations and uh, copy that. Defense station. I don't remember seeing all those mines, but uh, maybe I just didn't notice them. If I do that, will you go? Yep, there we go. Get into second contact, just so he can't be stuck there. We don't have the backup captain assigned. We go here. Oh, right, because I'm the cap. I am the captain. Yeah, we have 796 things in our inventory. Oh, yeah, because I have all of the pay jobs. Right. 
That is a thing. Uh, industrial espionage, deploy a satellite at the target position. Do I have a satellite on me? I do. I also have three males. So that's telling us about the, the wars on the Xenon and the Holy Order. And then we do have the promotion ceremony that we can do. Any mounting defense of second contact too. Beautiful. Just center minor there. You know, I didn't even look um, <clears throat> when we had the whole map uncovered at the new sectors. I mean, there's a couple of new sectors and points of interest. Didn't even think of it. I keep hitting F2 twice. <clears throat> I want to use just cats is sick. Never nice when an animal is sick. So we are in Grand Exchange 3. We'll head through the uh, super highway over there. It does make um, dodging and uh, I guess because oh, those are all her sanity melty metal health on legs. Ah, gotcha. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I understand that? An eye for an eye. Fifty grand. It's not bad for that. Uh, we can do that whenever, though. much to become an extension of you. Of course there is the existential threat that is uh, in the game also. I don't have access to, I believe it's a mission that uh, starts it. say is um, it does make strafing a little bit um, oh no you have to go into this mode yeah, you do yeah. interesting when you're uh, this camera mode and you're dodging around
And then I believe the U is in the base game now. If anyone doesn't know what the U is, it's the old uh, beta core ship. Albatross, Sentinel. Nice empty Grand Exchange one. Crane, E, mineral. Because we've only seen cranes. I suppose I haven't spent much time up in the um, core sectors for the Tladi. Interesting way they're highlighting the station now. It's very much more prominent. Warning or anything. Thanks for your help. Tilati Station Security Vessel A. Anyway, I was looking for a um <clears throat> a signal leak, but I guess we'll do that somewhere else. anyone else and uh, we can get the mission started here Purple HUD means we're in scan mode. Ministry of Finance, they're such they're such people. Hey lady succubus. That's the name. Never seen this before? The X4. Aaron. E. One of my favorite games, my favorite series. Oh, 
Hope you're doing well. Entering system. Nobilius Portia. We'll uh, just slide on through here. Seemingly there's a missile still following us with that red dot. Uh, let's stock up and sell what we can. I do need to find out like a black market so I can sell all that illegal stuff. We do pick up a lot of it. I just end up dumping it. When they give me the option, because they did not give me an option. Unless I completely blanked on that. Too far to walk. Uh, we're all good there. Looks so much better now. It, it does look great, doesn't it? Can I help? Here you go. We picked up crap. That's all we picked up. Just a bunch of crap. I think I have a bunch of missiles that I can sell. Safe journey. Delete Vanguard. Oh, wrong button. This is not Star Citizen. guys hear the oh, there it is they're a little harder to see than when it's all whited out the signal leak right here this will give us our intro to the mission also the shaders are looking good not sure what the shaders was. I can tell it's all smoother yeah it feels a lot smoother yeah Oh wait, did I actually need to press F? I thought I could just wait. Whoops. I thought you just had to wait for them. Oh. I think there's another one around here somewhere. Might as well scan the station while we're here. test TA. Yeah, I have nothing on at the moment. Um, nope, not that one. Throw it on. And again, frame counters in the bottom corner. I am playing on 1440p, pretty much everything up. Oh, that'll do. Oh, he's actually giving me a job? Ugh. Oh yeah, I'll go board that, yeah, no problem. Wait, so again, I haven't done 
headquarters thing in a long time. Okay, yeah, it, it is telling us to uh, do that. That's fine. It didn't give us the mission, did it? Delicate situation is going to be mines. I'll accept that. Deliver one unstable crystal. I have not got unstable crystals. Did I sell it? I must have sold it. It's fine. We can do that at some point. This I don't want to do in an elite. RT is very performance friendly compared to SMA. I don't know, man. I don't. I don't really use anti-aliasing to be honest. Generally, I just don't bother. For me, it doesn't make a huge amount of difference. And then by the time it goes onto YouTube, it's compressed, so. It's hilarious when you watch it back and it's like, what I see and what you can see on YouTube or on Twitch is uh, slightly different. You need to, you're playing on a big TV. Oh, gotcha. I'm, um, what am I on? 32 inch? 32 inch curved monitor. Yeah. 4K is not enough for a TV, yeah. I used to play, I have my like 55 inch TV over there for a while now. And yeah, I used to try playing on that with my old computer and my God, no. <laughs> I didn't I didn't keep trying that for long. And we took a mission to blow up mines. Which of course are back that direction. Game is looking very good, running very well. Uh, we've had a few stutters. But I'm pretty sure that was kind of LOD thing with the new ships popping in. How is he doing? He's getting there, slowly. He's only on a low um, bit, so there's that. Problem with older AA techniques is that it can be blurry to his keeping it crisp, so I'm happy to have it. Oh yeah. You'd have to see it in um, like a, f a fight or, you know, with fighters zipping around and stuff. Oh, 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 no, 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 go away, go away. Don't get close. <laughs> you don't get a warning when they're sneaking up on you unless you see them. That would have one shot us. All right, we'll head back over towards the flashpoint because the Holy Order and the God Realm are going to be fighting in the next system, so that's always fun. 
Where's my radar? What did I do? Parts of the hood have disappeared, okay. I'll check controls here in a second. the loot without the radar. No, not that. Um, what am I after doing? Is there a button to turn on and off the radar? I didn't think there was, so it's probably just a bug. Yeah, I don't. I don't have a, anything um, set there. Uh, just if you're ever wondering, there is a display FPS scanner kind of thing. You just need to put a hotkey on it. Hmm. Yeah, man. So yeah, th th it was not going to be compatible. No way it was going to be compatible. Oh wait, are we back? We're back. That fleet versus that fleet. Six FPS. Right, two FPS and the difference is not. Huge, if you really want the anti-aliasing there. Must be the beta, ah, it must be, yeah, yeah. Well, look, there's a big fight going on. Look at all the missiles. I've noticed a lot of um, missile spam lately. X4 is a CPU game. Um, I have a 5900X. what I use. Oh, what I mean is the GPU isn't the issue there? Yeah, but it's the only thing I can change. <laughs> so, if it can make any difference.
but damn, you can zoom out a good bit, can't you? <laughs> nice. Yeah, the new uh, the new explosions are pretty sweet. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Also that, the burning after. Okay, if you go back, if you pause the game, go into the, the menu, uh, you'll get your radar and stuff back. A few bits coming into us. So we need to find an unstable crystal and sell it, which is no problem. We can do that like pretty much anywhere. Argon space is a safe bet. Uh, second contact will be good too. Gonna grab this loot and then we'll move on. Two bits that we can pick up. Could be the audio as well. You notice the corresponding to the explosions. It's not the actual explosions, it's the audio. Triple air face. Double. Ah, triple. Yeah, obviously in fights like that, it's going to tank a bit. Entering system. Through sight. Ooh, Xenon. Our ships. Be second contact anyway. Contact. The Xenon laser tower? Drop laser tires before? Helios E. Correct of a Helios E. There are some explosions happening. It's all the loot exploding, that's probably what it is. Two behemoths over there. We should keep our guy safe. He's gonna, he's gonna go before. That's how they're getting into Argon Prime and stuff. They're popping in here, going straight to the highway and then going into Argon Prime. Oh, there's a fight going on down here. You see that little shift in the camera then when um, we lost our lock on the Xenon? Sir, 
Cerebra. Sentinel. Beware of all these little things. Alright, we'll go back to Hateko's choice. Oh, actually, I don't. Do a quick bit of crystal mining. Grab the unstable crystal, then we can take it and uh, drop it off there, and that should should give us access to the black market, I think. And that will allow us to sell all of our other stuff. Pretty sure turning off the hood doesn't turn off the blinks, right? Not a single unstable crystal. Okay. Yeah, like moving around like this, it just makes it feel so much more dynamic, which is really nice. So like when you're travel driving, dodging a bit. Kingdoms End in the turn change, char change theme, charge theme. Sorry, never get old playing this game. Yeah. Yeah, you'll often see me um, just turn off the hood, fly around a bit, or watch something while they're playing. Um, right wrong button but anyway uh this entering system blue site actually what what is the mission reward here 76,000 credits so yeah that's not what i'm thinking of anyway doesn't matter we make 76,000 credits entering system holy vision
Alright, we have 500,000. I could, like, buy two more miners. And then let them work a bit before we play again next. Um, let's see. We might start with X4 tomorrow. It's a little, little jumpy when you're moving about like that, but that's fine. Ooh, private apartment. been to Night City. Elite Vanguard. Our rep isn't good enough for them to even look at their ships, fair enough. Nova, a high preset would be 1.25 million. No, thank you. 900,000. 800,000. That's still only with them? Okay. 894,000. Could go discover. I was doing a play along with your Amaron, but now I think I have to try out the beta. Did the notice the love flip? Yeah, man, it's um, there's a lot to it. I'm actually thinking of holding off on the, the Amaron until they are possibly updated to this. Um, there's a lot of quality of life. A lot of little improvements here and there. Um, and then obviously a few big changes. But yeah, it uh, it feels a lot better. I think if I was to go back now, um, wouldn't be great. <laughs> I think we might continue the Amara run, but not right now. We'll, I think we might focus on the, the Argon run in this. A few little issues, but it is a beta, so, you know, it is what it is. Almost get rid of all mods since then I know it's polishing wide range features as well as quality of life aspects yet. Yeah. Exactly, and it's only the foundation. Imagine what five and six are gonna be like. Elite Someone else stated, man, it's really sex five with boarding. <laughs> First person boarding. As the only mod I have on at the moment is the uh, paint mod because it won't affect anything.
Um, I'll probably just set course back over to take that. We might shoot a few things. Uh, what else do we have? We have the promotion ceremony. Oh, do they? That's good. Again, I'll say it one more time. The only thing that bugs me about the new camera is that it's attached to the rotation of the ship at the moment. And I wish there was a way just to, like, detach it. We have to go Argon in the beta. Terrans would never allow me to incorporate some of these new cool Xenon ships. Argon, however. <laughs> also, the Argon have new ships. I'll do it through this because it's easier. They new versions of their ships, I should say, right? Oh, that's an interesting one there. Entering system. Claim. That's an interesting distinction there, isn't it? Heavy construction ships. Entering system. Holy mission. Are there going to be light construction ships? Are there already light construction ships? These though, these are the ones I want to look at. Trader flying through uh, holy order space. Good luck to you. Entering system. You're addicted to the reverse engineering mod in the capital ship loot magnet, though. Yeah, I actually, I presume the reverse engineering mod should work with 7.0. It's just a building, right? Entering system. Argon Prime. I wouldn't imagine the beta will because the AI has been changed even if it's only been changed a little bit. What do you difference in detail? Um, I like that they've been extended in length. Same with the Odysseus. I always thought it was very stubby and chubby. Glad they did that. And yeah, that's like the update. Reiterations are always going to look better anyway, do you know? Oh, I didn't tell it to dock, did I? I just told it to, um... Auto I am near a shipyard, thank you. I suppose um, this is the thing, right? Um, I could have that zoomed out and that be the... to give people a reason to back into the game over years oh yeah yeah i think they've always said that was a long-term project um right let's actually dock here but the x series has always been like that when x4 launched everyone was like oh but x3 was so great it's like yeah but not at release x3 was polished over a couple of years and actually two other releases of an X3 game because it takes a long time to do all that gimme 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 we've been watching your work with great interest 
You completely bounced off it? I put a lot of hours into Rebirth because I wanted to like it. And I'd play it. I'd even go back and do a run of it, but... Is your neck okay? You might buy the VR version to around some point. Eh. Alright, we've got our police license, which is actually the main thing. Oh, and we got paid. We got paid by the silicon miner. Oh, the hall is 900. The hall is 1.2 million. I don't remember that. That being that expensive, but okay. We could get the quasar. Eh? I mean, we can't afford the Quasar, of course, but that's fine. Oh, that's because it has the pricey weaponry on it now, doesn't it? Oh, wait, 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 the Eclipse. Yeah, I don't need whatever those weapons are. Um, or them. Like, I'd be happy putting those on it for now. It brings down the price, but it's not going to bring it down enough. Nine ten. You kidding me? It's a thousand. We're out by a thousand. I bring the shields down and then can I put back up the engines? No. Alright, we'll buy an eclipse. Just so we have something better than this feckin' thing. Um I'm not in the seat, so we can go open this up here. Promote that to a pilot. Rand Landa. That's the name. I'm gonna tell him to go dock and wait there. That I'm not a fan of. And I'm going to keep saying it. So I don't know what the goal in this run is going to be. I think I'll try and do a bunch of the storylines. But seemingly I don't have them unlocked. So again, like once I get up to a decent sized ship. That's exactly not what I was thinking at all, Sully. So I happen to know two of them. That do pop in. But I, I, I don't like it just because of 
preference, but I'd also be wondering like if um, it's going to affect people that don't like have motion sickness, but want to watch what's going on from outside. You know what I mean? Is a fight like if you want to watch your fighter fly around and you just want to plop your camera there, you don't want to have to have it spinning around every time he doesn't move and all this kind of stuff. I need to update that because um, I put gold in on the wings. Or not gold, but amber. I'm sure, Nister will keep an eye out somebody, hopefully. Hey, bags. Just arriving as I'm about to go because I need to go to work. Uh, I'm actually going to be late. Maybe. And. Uh, Yeah, sorry man, it's the timing. Boom. Alright, we'll throw it right over to uh, Wasted, who's learning it. Wasted space. Alright guys, have a good one, and uh, I'll catch you again tomorrow. We'll be doing more 7.0.